President Trump on yet another Twitter tear, slamming everyone and everything surrounding the impeachment inquiry, the Bidens, the whistleblower, uh, Chairman Adam Schiff, and adding to his long list of lies and false claims about all of these subjects. CNN's Daniel Dale fact checks President Trump for a living. That's his actual job. And he joins me now. Daniel, President Trump uh, tweeted, quote, the first so-called secondhand information whistleblower got my phone conversation almost completely wrong. So now word is they are going to the bench and another, quote, whistleblower is coming in from the deep state also with secondhand info. Wow, there's a lot to unpack in that. But let's just start with the idea. Is the whistleblower claim completely wrong, as the president says? N not at all, Jake. The whistleblower had a three bullet point list about this call, and all three of those bullet points were effectively corroborated by the transcript or the rough transcript released by the White House itself. So let's, let's go through all three. Number one was that Trump pushed Ukraine's president to investigate the Bidens. Correct. True, yes. Trump pushed the president of Ukraine to investigate this debunked Ukraine server conspiracy theory. Correct. True, yeah. Number three was Trump pushed Zelensky to speak to his own lawyer Giuliani and the attorney general Barr. That's correct as well. Now the one caveat, Trump seems to take issue with the whistleblower saying this was pressure. Trump says, oh, it was a, it was a friendly talk, a friendly request. So he can quibble with the use of the word pressure. But in terms of the substance of those allegations, all of them have been confirmed. Not to mention the White House has acknowledged on background that the transcript was then put in the secret f file server. Sure. Exactly. Which is also in the whistleblower complaint. It is. So t Trump tweeted that he thinks that Speaker Pelosi and Chairman Adam Schiff should be impeached. Uh, fact check that for us. Jake, there is no, as you know, there is no impeachment for members of the House. Members of the House can do impeaching of other people, like the president. They can be expelled, but not impeached. And Trump also got wrong the reasons that he said those two should be impeached. He said they should be impeached for treason. Nothing they've done even approaches the constitutional definition of treason. And he said that Schiff illegally met, or his, his committee staff illegally met with the whistleblower. It is routine for the House Intelligence Committee to meet with potential whistleblowers. Nothing about this is illegal at all. And then lastly, the president also referenced this picture of uh, former Vice President Joe Biden golfing. Uh, let's put it up there if we can, which was also misleading. It, it was, yeah. So, so Trump said that uh, this photo showed Joe Biden golfing with the, quote, company boss of Burisma, the Ukrainian natural gas firm. The gentleman in question, Devin Archer, was a longtime business associate of Biden's son, Hunter Biden, who was also on the board of directors, like Hunter Biden was. A board member is not the company boss. So again, Trump misidentified someone to try to serve his political purposes.